Tip 1. Do a monthly inspection of the battery terminals to make sure they are clean and corrosion-free Extend the lifespan of a car battery of the first problems most people have with their car battery is the buildup of corrosion around the terminals. Corrosion destroys the connection between the battery and the vehicle and many batteries are replaced due to too much corrosive buildup. But oftentimes, this can be easily treated by simply pouring a small amount of cola or a DIY anti-corrosion paste, one part water to three parts baking soda, over the corroded areas. The acid in the cola or the alkaline properties in the DIY anti-corrosion paste will eat the corrosion away. After the corrosion is gone, use a clean damp rag or sponge to clean up the remaining residue and moisture. Be sure to let it dry, then rub some petroleum jelly on the terminals to prevent future corrosion. Asterisk note, wear your safety gear before disconnecting, reconnecting your battery. Tip 2. Do not operate any car accessories, radio, lights, or electronics before turning on the car ignition and driving the car when the car is on. The car alternator generates electricity and charges the car battery after the battery has a voltage drop. Leaving car lights on while car is off drains the car battery but if the car is not on, and you are using the car's electronics, you are just relying on the car battery to power those electronics. This is detrimental to the car battery because car batteries are not meant for this type of use. Instead, car batteries are meant to provide a sudden burst of power for ignition. They're not made to provide prolonged power for electronics and other devices, that's what a deep cycle lead acid battery would be for. Using your car battery as a battery that powers electronics, instead of a battery that just gives you a burst of power for ignition, will damage the battery and greatly shorten its lifespan if it's repeatedly used in this fashion. So avoid operating any car accessories or electronics while the car is off. Tip 3. Make sure the car battery is secure and has good battery cables prolong the life of the car battery has to be secured at all times. If a battery is jostling around it will be impaired and could short circuit. This will ruin the battery, and even cause damage to your car while creating a safety risk. The same could happen if you have bad battery cables, or they're not connected properly. So check your cables and make sure they have a secure connection as well. Tip 4. Insulate your car battery from extreme changes in temperature Protecting your car battery from large changes in temperature will help maximize the battery's lifespan. To do this you can use a car battery insulation kit. Car battery insulation kit newer model cars already have these kits installed typically. But if your car doesn't have one, you can easily install one yourself. Just make sure it fits your car's battery compartment. Generally, the companies selling these battery insulation kits will have a form on their website where you can put in your car model and year, and it will tell you if your battery will fit their kit, like here. These protective battery sleeves are usually made of plastic or an acid-resistant, thermal-resistant material. These car battery insulation kits will insulate your battery and protect it while still allowing proper ventilation. Tip 5. Fully charge your car battery at least once a week. Use a car battery charger or interchange batteries if you have two. Your car battery drains even when the car is off. This happens because the current is drawn from the battery by car accessories, radio, lights, etc. or the car computers. This is why people come home from long vacations and find their car battery dead. But to prevent this, you can use either a car battery charger or a solar battery charger. Car battery chargers, regular or solar will maintain the optimum charge level of your car battery when the car is not in use. They do this by providing enough power for the car accessories and car computer, so they don't continuously draw current from the car battery when the car is off. As you can imagine, these chargers are very useful, especially if you go on a trip or leave your car unused for a while. They're also useful if you go on a lot of short car trips, like to work and back each day and never give your battery a chance to fully recharge. Repeatedly doing this will dramatically shorten your battery's life, unless you use a car battery charger or interchange batteries, leaving one at home to fully charge. The most important thing to remember with this tip is, make sure you fully charge your car battery at least once a week because it will greatly increase the life of your battery. Do this with a charger, interchanging batteries, or just going on a car ride long enough to recharge the battery. Tip 6. Check your car battery's water level Most car batteries indicate if there is a need for water. 
So check the car battery water level indicator regularly and if the water is needed, refill the battery with distilled water, and that's important, only use distilled water to refill your car battery. Tip 7. Do not overcharge your car battery Never overcharge your car battery. Lead acid batteries release oxygen and hydrogen gases when they're overcharged. This causes two problems, it can be explosive. It also breaks down the composition of the water in the battery, which shortens its lifespan. Tip 8. Check your car's alternator If the car battery is not charging, check the car's alternator You're doing everything we've recommended in this video but your car batteries are still dying early, you'll want to check your car's alternator, or get a mechanic to check it. If your alternator is bad it will results in ineffective recharging of your battery and dramatically shorten your battery's lifespan.